kids, we're going to learn about vertically opposite angles. Vertically opposite angles are formed when two lines intersect. They also share a common vertex. As you can see in the drawing, line AB and line CD intersect at point O. This means that angle AOD and angle BOC are vertically opposite angles. Similarly, the horizontal angle AOC and angle BOD are also vertically opposite angles. Did you know that vertically opposite angles are equal to each other? For our first example, we're going to take two sticks, a black stick and a red stick and attach it to each other somewhere in the middle. Now, let's move these sticks a little bit and see what happens to them. As you can see, the angles on both the sides change a little bit. The vertically opposite angles become larger and smaller along with each other. Let's now mark out a few examples of this on the paper underneath and see if the vertically opposite angles are in fact equal or not. As you can see, I've already marked out a few of these figures. The red line covers the red line, the black line covers the black line. One more. Alright, let's now take a protractor and measure the angles that have been formed. I'll place the midpoint of the protractor at the point of intersection of the two lines and the bottom part of the protractor exactly on the red line. As you can see, the angle now formed measures 61 degrees. Let's now try this on the opposite side. Again, midpoint of the protractor on the point of intersection and the bottom line of the protractor on the red line. The angle now formed is again 61 degrees. This means that the vertically opposite angles are in fact equal. Let's try this with our second figure. I'm going to place the midpoint of the protractor on the point of intersection and the bottom line of the protractor on the black line. The angle formed by the red line measures 65 degrees. Let's now try this on the opposite side. Again, midpoint on the point of intersection and the bottom line of the protractor on the black line. The angle formed by the red line is again 65 degrees. This tells us that vertically opposite angles formed by two lines intersecting are in fact equal. Even objects around us can show vertically opposite angles. For example, when I open a pair of scissors, the angles formed on either side are equal to each other. They are vertically opposite angles. Bye guys!